A welcome change for hundreds of CMS students as extracurricular activities started back up today. Football, basketball, cheerleading, lacrosse, and soccer teams all started practicing again. And art programs like music and theater are also resuming. That step toward a return to normal is something both parents and pediatricians are happy to see. WCNC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez explains the impact this quarantine is having on our children's health. We were kind of shocked at, at the waking of, of two of my kids, and it was something that was really eye-opening. Mom of three, Flavia Benton, says her once active family is now spending a lot of time sitting around at home, and it's showing up on the scale. Just a lack of you know mobility, not going around and running around with, with friends. The quarantine 15, not just for adults, as pediatricians in the Charlotte area reporting seeing children as young as seven or eight years old that gained as much as 20 pounds since the shutdown last year. You know, our kids are really kind of feeling those, those effects, unfortunately, uh, in a negative way. When children find that they're gaining weight, that lends to bullying, that lends to teasing, that lends to all these other um, emotional health issues. Dr. Carla Robinson points to a few culprits. Depression is a big one. Mental health has been, I think, the most underrated aspect of the pandemic. But also, kids are snacking more and exercising less. Charlotte Mecklenburg schools resume in-season high school programs for a number of sports like basketball, cheerleading, soccer, and football this week. Something Dr. Robinson says will definitely help with the older kids. But she says for the younger ones, we have to get creative and committed when it comes to getting kids off the couch. I think with the open mindset of, hey, this is sports, but it may be sports uh, repackaged or it may be sports in a different, different fashion that I think we can certainly be open to still reaping the benefits that sporting activities can bring, uh, but just being, being so and being mindful of it in a safe way. In Charlotte, Tanya Mendes, WCNC Charlotte.